Hello everybody, it's the Electrocutioner and welcome back to Kirby and the Forgotten Land. Last time we did the first world and we evolved, um, we evolved Cutter and Fire into, oh boy, Shaw Rank, Shaw Realm, Shaw Realm, Cutter and Volcano Fire. And saw some new mouthful modes, like the Locker, um, and a few others, I can't remember. Stairs, yeah. This time, we're gonna be doing, uh, the second world. We're splitting it up. Last time we did the whole first world, and the episode was an hour long. So, this time, we're splitting it up. You know, that's what we're gonna be doing from now on. So, we're gonna have, do like three levels or something. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Can't really split up five, so we'll do, uh, we'll kind of go with three now. Maybe two now and three, um, next time. So that's what we'll do. So we'll do two world, two levels now and three next time. Here we are at Everbay Coast, starting on an abandoned beach. So the second world is actually a, a water world. Kind of unusual for that to be a sand world, but here we go, though. First time 3D on a beach. Got some melons. Um, um, I don't know. I told you in the first episode, I don't know many of the enemies' names. But in this one, we'll run into some more mouthful modes. I decided to get sword real fast, by the way. Because I felt like it, you know. Anyways, coins. You're asleep. I guess I can show that off. Sleep. You sleep. You just, you know, kind of falls asleep. It repeatedly just tap a button to wake them up. And that's the end of the copy buddy. It's the most useless one. Because you just fall asleep automatically. It's crazy. Anyways. Ooh, collectible. I don't think I even got this one la last time. There it is. Cutter. I'll take it. We just evolved Cutter. So I'll, I'll take that. Okay. Okay. Gator will spring up from under you and eat you. Crack open three knock knock nuts. Alright. Yeah, the reason we're splitting this up is because the last one was three hour, not an hour long, so I don't want to do that again. So we're splitting up from now on. Cutter or fire? I'll take fire. Because once again, we evolved it into volcano fire last time. Here we go. Wild bonkers. The fire stays on them. The copy buddies are so much better than they are in the other games. And he's already dead. Remember, bosses? Eat them. This one you get hammer. Yes, hammer. Very short range attack, but it's really powerful. Do three power, do, do, do three attacks. And you do that big hit at the end. You can charge it up to do a, charge it up to have fire and boom, do that. Very cool. It's a very powerful move. Um, hey, it's, it's short range, but it's very powerful. Yeah, this is one of the most powerful moves you can get. All right, let's come over here and go up this ladder. This and we have a hidden waddle dee. Nice. Anything else in there up there? Ooh, sneaky. 
I think those are like worth five coins. I think the red ones are worth ten. Those are worth five. I'm not really sure. But, um, Scarfy here. You don't want to try to suck these up because they'll come after you. Like, they're the cutest enemies until you try to attack them. Then they're not so cute anymore. Destroy the animal sand sculpture. Cool. Um, I already have hammer, so good. Step in these whirlpools, you'll get hurt. It actually takes a big chunk of your health away. That's not good. Some cherries. Just got her health back. Oh no. Oh, get out of there. In the air, just like sword, you can push B in the air. And you'll do like a spinning attack with the hammer. Just like sword. What do we have up here? Up, up. Oh, see? They're the cutest animals until you attack them or try to suck them up. Then they come after you and be not so cute anymore. Um, so yeah, they're really freaky actually when they're like that. this down. And this one has a timer. Actually exploding the blocks. Move it. Move it. There you go. music oh this takes me oh back to the same place okay I'm, I thought it was losing my mind oh click up here <laughs> Friggin' cyclones? I think those are what those are called. Cyclones! Dang it. Uh, move! What I was trying to do was attack that guy. I freaking couldn't get out of it. Get, couldn't get out of it. Getting caught in those whirlpools. All right, here's another new mouthful mode. We got the ring mouth. This Kirby can blow objects like that, wind blast. Break objects, kill enemies, and even spin windmills. That, nah, of course, actually it's stuck. Die, die, die. Another thing. Push this air can you be used on the boat to push the boat around. And you are unaffected by the these whirlpools when you're doing this. Up, oh, crack open three knock knock nuts, two of three. Yeah, I missed the first one in the first area. I think so. Oh well. Take that. Oh, it's the end of the level. Okay.
Blue Sage, save the hidden Waddle Dees, crack open three knock knock nuts, destroy the animal sand sculpture, complete the sign on the rooftop. Well, I barely did anything. Collectibles, hothead. That's what those guys are called. It's radio. Hop on, boys. Six out of nine. Not bad. Take away the slash and you know what you have? I'm not going to say it. Two treasure roads. Hammer treasure. And that's what happens if you already have the ability. Hit the stakes. Let's do this. I'm probably not going to be talking much during these because I'm going to have to need, I'm going to have to concentrate. So most of these probably not going to have commentary over them. The spinning around hammer move is just so awesome. And it covers a wider area, it covers all sides up and down here. Remember, you can even charge it up to eventually include fire and do that. Very cool. And that's it. Ah, oh, man. Minute one. And the target time was 45 seconds. Are you kidding me? Whatever. Concrete Isles is the next one. Okay. Diamonds. You find five of these in it. Creates a green coin, or or it creates something other than a green coin. Oh, let's look up this guy, and you get crash. It's a new ability, not new, but it's a one-time item that you know is a screen nuke. But like I said, it's a one-time item, so once you use it, it's gone. I'll use it here. Charge it up. God power! <laughs> Boom! Kills every enemy on the screen and bosses it does a lot of damage. Kind of wanted to save that for a boss, but um, I guess not. I guess not. Maybe I can find another one. Let's actually go back and see can't float high enough. I can swim though. Here, let me go see go back and see if I can get another crash. Probably not. Nah. Yeah, don't see, don't try to suck up Scarfies, because they'll get you. And they eventually explode. Crazy. Alright. Oop. New copy booty on the horizon. Some corn here. Oh. 
Meet Drill. There's a new ability to return. There's a new ability to end the Forgotten Land. Okay. Drill is a new ability to the Kirby series. There you go. Drill is a completely new ability to the Kirby series. Drill underground. Her enemies when you pop up. And you can even dive like that. When you land, you're going to dig. And you can even do that for an attack in the air. Pretty cool. Obviously, you can't do it to metal, but it's pretty cool. You know, it's a pretty cool ability. And this part is also from the trailer. Coming up on that guy. And I almost did see that ability. Or, I almost didn't see that collectible. What the frick out, boy. I'm just gonna take your power. It will eventually make you come up whether you want to or not. If you're underground for too long, it will automatically make you come up. Trap that guy into dying. Going to the Gordo here. Or trick that guy into dying, not trap. Can you trap? I guess you can. This is dark. And we got the crane mouth. Or that's probably not what it's called, but I'm calling it that. Spit, spit up the top to be at the top there. Alright, there's five. And there's another hidden water D. Good. Up. Die. Yeah, go in the water, even though that won't kill you. Okay. Next area. Okay. I'm gonna wait, I think. Please tell me that comes back out. It does. Good. Ooh, star. Star one. Oh! And warp star. Oh, it just brings us up here. And a pipe mouth. Another new mouthful thing. A to jump. And I pushed A. There you go. Thank you. And the fifth one. And I missed the third one. Oh well. I'm not gonna get a hundred percent, so yeah, try to get all those I can, but I'm not I'm not gonna get a hundred percent. Dig dig up a maximum tomato. Wow, I definitely didn't do that last time. And there's the end of the level. Came and went. Came and went. The stage save the hidden wild D's. Dig up a maximum tomato. Increase three seabirds. Wow, did almost nothing. Again. Captured wild D. One of the wild D is being held captive by the fearsome beast pack. There are so many out there waiting to be saved. You can almost hear them calling for help. Wah, 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 wah. Let me out. Let me out. Wait, hear that too? One of them must be nearby. 
Okay. And this a wolfie? A common beast that can be found all over the New World. They're pretty cute, but they have a dangerous wild side. They'll growl and jump at anyone who cro crosses them. A whole bunch of these critters attack the Waddle Dees. Funny. You'd think they'd get along. Because they're both cute. Yeah. That would make the most sense. But unfortunately, that's not the case. Alright. Open scale the cement summit. There you go. Open the one more thing of treasure road. Drill treasure. Looks like they finished a new building in town. Let's go take a look. Yep. We'll take a look at that next time. So that's going to be it next time on Kirby and the Forgotten Land. We'll do the rest of World 3, 2, sorry, we'll do the rest of World 2 and see what other mouthful modes that we can find. And we'll do these other two treasure roads too. See you guys then.